Yo, what's going on guys? I'm Deadly Psycho and welcome back to another Black Ops 4 video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the best way to get your long shot medals in Black Ops 4 multiplayer so that you can get your gold weapons and work towards that dark matter camo or if you just want to get long shots to get extra XP. Whatever the case is, I'm going to show you guys the best way to do that and best practices for getting those long shots as well as some of the best spots in every map for long shots. Just a couple extra tips for you guys. Definitely play hardcore because it's so much easier to get a long shot if you only have to shoot once or twice than it is to have to shoot three or four times just to kill somebody at range. With range being said, long barrel and suppressor don't shorten or lengthen the range of the weapon's long shot. So you can use long barrel and you can get those long shots at the same distance and still get the long shot metal. And you can use the suppressor and you would still have to be killing people at that same distance. So it would be a disadvantage to have suppressor but it would definitely help you to use long barrel so I suggest using long barrel on anything that you can when you're going for these long range kills and play some hardcore just to make it a little bit easier to finish these challenges please keep in mind that the weapons that you're gonna have to get these long shots for are snipers assault rifles tactical rifles and pistols pistols are gonna be the shortest range and they're gonna be about 20 meters assault rifles and tactical rifles are gonna be about 40 meters and sniper rifles are anything past that so make sure you plan accordingly and you're not trying to get some pistol long shots in one of these spots if it's impossible to do because you can do it in some shorter areas or you're not trying to get a sniper long shot in one of the shorter AR long shot spots so keep that in mind and let's get into it ladies and gentlemen we are on the map arsenal and we're going to take a look at some of these long shot spots that you guys can use to get long shots in your games. So first up, we're at the cafeteria area and we wanna get some long shots. So we're gonna step up onto this plant bed and we're gonna head to this corner and we'll be able to get some long shots on those people over there that are head glitching at that spot right there. So keep in mind that this is a really open spot and you're gonna be able to get shot very easily. So pick off some people and then move on. Another spot is right in here on this, in this window. You want to keep your back to the wall, touching the wall, and then you want to be able to shoot past that aircraft right there. And you'll be able to get some long shots on people that are peeking around that corner or running around back there on that back wall. You'll be able to head glitch right here and you'll be able to shoot those people right there and get some long shots. You'll be able to shoot people coming around that corner right there on top of that little plant bed. You'll be able to get them from here by head glitching and killing them very easily. You can also step up on here and then creep up and you'll be able to kill them from here as well. Some better spots though, if you want, you can hop up onto here and you'll be able to shoot them very easily. Keep in mind you are very exposed out here. Everybody can see you from everywhere so you can kill those guys from there. This might not get you some sniper long shots but you have more cover and you'll be seen less and you'll be able to get those shots. So my next best one for this map, and I love doing this one because you can get a lot of sniper long shots is right here. Step up on here and then you'll be able to kill those people coming from over there. They'll be waiting around the corner or whatever the case is, but you'll be able to kill them very easily and get those long shots. So that's it for the map arsenal. I'll see you guys in the next map. Next up, we are on the map contraband and there's some spots that are pretty good in contraband. So let's head on over to the middle of the map. So from this side of the map, you can sit here in the back of this wall and you'll be able to kill people in the window that are camping and get those long shots some other spots that you can use is way back here behind this boat you can actually sit behind this boat and get some kills for long shots right over there so another spot is right over here if you sit back to the wall you'll be able to kill people in that window and same vice versa you'll be able to kill people in the window same with right here you'll be able to sit with your back to the wall and get some long shots by killing people in that window also you'll be able to kill people in that spot right there and get some long shots another one that's really good is right over here behind this boat you can sit behind this boat right here and you'll be able to get some long shots on people in that path right there that's all the spots in contraband i'll see you guys in the next map next up we're on the map firing range and there's a couple good spots that you can use so right here 
with your back against this wall, you'll be able to shoot into that tower over there and get those kills. Also, you can put your back against this wall. It's very dangerous, but you can get some kills over there and get some long shots as well. From here, you can get behind this wall right here. You can even step back as far as you can and then get shots into tires to get some long shots. Also, you can hop up onto this trash can right here and then shoot that way to get a bunch of long shots as well. Something else you can do is hop up up here and then shoot back there into tires and get some long shots there as well. And to counter that spot over there, you can just get some long shots right here by shooting into that building right there or back that way. Also, another really good one is getting behind these boxes right here. And you can actually see up into the stairs and you can get some kills on people sitting on that corner in the staircase going into the garage and that's all the spots for firing range so i'll see you guys in the next map moving on to the map frequency we have a bunch of spots over here on this cliff side so right over here you can hide behind this building and you can get some long shots to the other side of the building and vice versa so both sides will work you can get some long shots to each other and get some kills another spot is from over here you can hop up onto this and get some kills on people coming from that direction or that are hiding behind that piece of cover right there so or you can hop up onto this railing right here and you can get some shots into that building over there and you can get some long shots from here as well so this works on both sides for every single one of these spots you can hop up onto this railing you can get some kills in that window you can hop behind this building right here and you can get some long shots towards that direction or you can hop up over here hop up on this railing you don't have to hop up on the railing you can shoot people over there but if you do hop up on the railing you'll be able to get some kills and i just fell off whatever it doesn't matter but that's it for the spots on frequency and we're moving on into the next map next up we're on the map gridlock and this map actually has a lot of spots that you can use for long shots so if you put your back against this wall you'll be able to kill people in that center area and get some long shots moving up we have a bunch of spots over here so we're gonna hop up into this building and if you put your back against this wall as well you'll be able to kill people over there in that spot. So you can move to this corner and you can kill them or you can sit right here and you'll be able to shoot them through that and get some long shots. Also, if you want to, you can jump up onto this and you can kill people over there as well for some long shots. Hopping back into this building, you can run over here, put your back against this wall as well and you'll be able to kill people in that cover or over there behind that piece of cover as well and on this side of the map you can hide behind this police car and you'll be able to shoot into that window over there and get a bunch of long shots as well you can even hide under here and it'll be even better for you you won't be able to be seen like literally at all you can shoot through there and you can even back up if you need to get a little bit extra of a distance running around this truck you can hide behind this cover over here and you can get some shots over there on those people. If you back up even further, you'll have even better of a long shot advantage to get those long shots. And you can also peek around and get some long shots there. It's a little bit more dangerous, but it is possible. You can run up into this piece of cover over here and you'll be able to get some kills over there and get some long shots. You can also hide over here and get some long shots as well. And then you can also hop up on here, get those same long shots and then shoot over there at those people that are coming around that corner or camping behind that piece of cover. That's it for the map gridlock and we're moving on into the next map. Moving on to the map Hacienda. I don't really like this map for long shots, but it is possible to get some if you happen to play this map and actually have to play this map. So moving to this side of the map, you can actually get out into this balcony and then get into this corner right here and you'll be able to shoot people and get kills that way. Also, if you run down here, get behind this cover, you'll be able to kill people coming from that direction and get some long shots. 
or you can actually just step in front of it and then if you can kill people right there that'll also be another good spot for long shots as well and that's it for the map hacienda next up is the map icebreaker and from here if you back up and push forward just a little bit you can start to see that cover over there and you'll be able to kill people off and get some long shots also if you push up to this cover right here and you kill those people off over there you're gonna get some long shots and vice versa and the same thing from this piece of cover if you're shooting over there into the spawn if you're shooting over there into that piece of cover you'll be able to get some long shots from there also if you're right over here you can pick off a lot of people coming around this corner or over there by shooting them getting some long shots as well from here another good spot is if you hop up onto the tracks of this snow plow you can shoot through this window and get a bunch of long shots over there as well it isn't a bad spot for shooting into the ship as well or into that piece right there but keep in mind you are very exposed on your right side you can also hop up onto this track there as well and then shoot the people over there and get some long shots also from this piece of cover at bdom you'll be able to shoot into the spawn over there if you peek around the corner get some kills that way you can also shoot back over that way and get some kills as they're coming up it is a little bit more difficult because most people will push up to the cover and you won't get the long shot so keep that in mind if you're touching this wall right here you'll be able to get some long shots on that piece of cover over there and that'll be an easy long shot for you another really good spot for long shots is coming into this building back in here in the back and then shooting through this to get some long shots on that piece of cover or anybody that is by those tanks you'll be able to get long shots very easily and that's it for this map we're moving on to the next one all right we are on the map jungle and jungle is not terrible for long shots but the first spot is coming over here laying prone and you can definitely get some kills on people camping on that rock on pride rock so those are some good spots you can also lay prone and kill some people that are coming through down there and get some possible long shots as well and the reverse of that is sitting right here at the bottom of this mountain and killing people down there as well this one's a little bit more exposed but you can definitely get a bunch of kills down there and get some long shots you can also head up to the top of pride rock and definitely get a bunch of kills down there as well also if you hop up into bdom hut you can sit back here and get a bunch of kills down there and get some long shots you can aim up into those people in the other hut over there and get kills or the people that are running towards the hut and you'll get a bunch of kills and long shots shooting that way another good spot is hanging out back here you can actually kill people up that way towards the path and get some long shots or you can actually lay prone right here and get a bunch of kills on people that are in the hut over there another good spot is right here this one is a little bit more campy but you can definitely get some kills right there especially in hardcore if you want to get some long shots just by shooting right there that's it for the map jungle and i'll see you guys in the next map moving on to the map militia we actually have a few spots that you can use so if you're right over here on top of this hill you can actually shoot people down that way and get some long shots another spot is right over here if you lay prone right next to this rock you can actually see up into that cabin over there and you can get some kills on people that are camping in the cabin in that window and you'll be able to get some kills on them as well you can push up just a little bit if you want but i tend to go prone that way they see less of me and i can actually shoot them another good spot for getting long shots is right here if you see people coming around that corner you can actually kill them right here and you'll be able to get some long shots another good spot for long shots on militia is right in this church window or hole or whatever you can actually see back into their spawn over there and you'll be able to kill anybody that's coming around over there and same with from over there you'll be able to kill people in the church window and get a bunch of long shots from there so right over here you can actually lay prone or stand up and you'll be able to kill people in the church window and get a bunch of kills as well and that's it for this map we're moving on moving on to the map morocco if you sit back here way in the back you can actually kill people up there and get easy long shots or you can move towards the left and get those people over there around that corner those are going to be some easy long shots for you especially in hardcore you can also push up to this van right here and you have a little bit more cover and you'll be able to kill anybody up there and get those long shots 
that's really the only spot on this Morocco that ready. I can find. Moving on to the next map. Moving on to the map payload, we have a few spots, not too many, but if you want, you can head up to this cover right here and you can pick off people in that room over there and get some long shots. And if you find yourself in this room, you can also pick off people that are over there and get some long shots as well. And from this spawn, if you push up into the back, you can actually kill a lot of people that are coming around that corner over there and get some long shot medals for your efforts. And the last spot on payload is right over here in this spawn. You can actually kill people that are coming around that corner or hiding behind that cover and you'll get some long shots for that as well. But that's really it for payload. It's not one of the best maps for long shots either. And we're moving on to the next map. Moving on to the map seaside, you can actually hop up into the church and then get up into the top and you'll be able to kill people over there if they peek around the corner and get some long shots also if you want to counter those people in the church and get long shots you can actually touch this wall right here and peek around the corner and you'll be able to kill people up there in that window and get those kills and long shots at the same time another good counter to the church window is actually in the billiards room and you can actually get long shots from here as well so if you get behind the pool table touch your back to the wall and peek out you can actually kill people in the church window and get a bunch of long shots that way as well and the last spot on seaside is actually back down here you can actually run down back here and you can kill some people that are coming around that corner and get some kills and long shots as well that's really it for seaside and we're moving on to the next map moving on to the map slums if you're in this spawn you can hop up onto these picnic tables right here and you can shoot towards the police car and get a bunch of long shot kills Keep in mind, this isn't the best cover, so you're going to have to kill them off very quickly. Another good spot for long shots is if you find yourself over here in this area, in this spawn, you can hop up onto these benches right here, and you can actually see people coming around and head glitching that yellow trash can over there, and you can actually get long shots. If you want, you can peek out and kill them this way. I do like to keep myself undercover, though, so I like to shoot this way and get those kills and the final spot on slums is right over here you can actually hop up onto this and get some kills that way you can have some cover a little bit of cover and you can shoot into blue building and get a bunch of kills and long shots that way you can also look through this window for this van and get a bunch of kills that way and long shots as well if you want you can back up all the way and then you can get a bunch of long shots this way it's a little bit harder because it's a small hole but if you have a sniper, this will be more beneficial to you as well. So you can also hop up on here and you can see a little bit more of them. But that's it for the map slums. Moving on to the next map, we have the map summit. And this map is actually pretty trash for long shot spots. But there are a couple. So this one you can actually get into the trolley or gondola or whatever it's called. And you can actually get kills that way into the freaking window over there. But you have to wait till it swings and you can then shoot them and get those kills. It's not really that great of a spot. You can actually get better kills and long shots by shooting that way as people come around that corner and get those kills. Another spot that you can use is hopping up onto these barrels back here and aiming that way into the middle. And you'll be able to get some long shots if they're a little bit further or if they're running past, you'll be able to kill them and get some long shots. And that's really it for the map summit. Ladies and gentlemen, that's all the long shot spots, or at least the most viable long shot spots on all the standard maps for Black Ops 4 multiplayer. If you guys want to see the DLC maps, just let me know down in the comments below and I'll be sure to find the best ones for those maps and I'll post that video as soon as possible. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Check out some of my other videos and I'll see you guys in the next one. Done. So let me break, break, break it all down for you. I ain't never give it up, I ain't never you know give it up. You know I'm gonna take, take, taking that crown from you. I ain't worried about you, I ain't never So let me break, 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 break it all down for you. I ain't never give it up, I ain't never give it up. You know I'm gonna take, take, taking that crown from you. I ain't worried about you, I ain't here to make it back. Yeah. I ain't never slowing down, keep on going till I'm back.